Chitsi ya 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 chitsi ye. Chitsi ya 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 chitsi ye ye ye. Chitsi ya 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 chitsi ye. Hmm. What is that? Chitsi ya ya ya. It's a song called Sydney. Chitsi ya ya. It's a app where we meet on Saturday night. It's a app with my friends from Haiti. Really enjoy our time on Chitsi ya 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 chitsi ye chitsi. Jitsi, it's a Japanese kind of manga mm. logo where I ah, got it from the Apple app or something. Okay, so now we're mm, going to uh, have a time together and review the Joel's Army. Uh, New mercies, draws army uh, prophecy on Israel and Evelyn, uh, brother Evelyn and sister Israel from Bethel. So let's let's uh, say it plainly out loud. Uh, new mercies are coming your way. Yeah, they uh, they should be a Joel army in the making at least so may new mercies are coming your way to carry on the mission you are called for in this season don't let distractions or unprecise vision for direction disturb your projection orbit around israel's landscape narrative and literature's track for such a time as this do care for the homeless and comfort those in fear anxiety for their redemption is near says the lord of hosts my love for you is highly esteemed by the prayer house movement and the international christian embassy in israel in montreal at least remember humbleness will bring it to pass going further higher and stronger and longer residencies habitations as well as provisions as the establishing the, fo the foundations depends on the relation you have with me, says the Lord, and how deep and intimate you will. You will hold guard, cherish, hold guard and cherish that relation. So, um, ah, yeah, that was uh, given to me in uh, New Year's Eve of 2021. <laughs> And uh, let's let's go on with a little teaching by Graham Cook. I think I trans not transliterated. I transcribed. Where is it? Ah, I wrote here. En bénédiction exponentielle, aide-moi Seigneur dans ma pauvreté, ne plus penser à subverser, subverser la dualité des nations. Les élus et Israël corrompus, mais à bonifier le juste dans sa conduite. Si un diagnostic n'est pas tout à fait yeah, this is a, a citation from from Michel Fugain from uh, uh, the Big Bazaar group in uh, Quebec, Montreal in the 70s. He said, Si un diagnostic n'est pas tout à fait une accusation, elle est un guide vers le rétablissement du citoyen citadin des cieux comme de la terre. Uh, no, I wrote that, but he said something else about it. In one of his interviews, he said that uh, a diagnosis is a kind of like a, uh, when it's well done, when it's well done, the diagnosis is well done, and it's like a cute. Uh, it's um, it's like a work of art. That's what he said, Michel Fugain. Yeah, when when a di like a mental diagnosis diagnosis is uh, well done it is a work of art so we are works of art in uh, becoming it eh? yeah so unprecedented my life launching a passion passover on 25th december to be interrupted yeah on the 29th for two three days of retreat for the new year yeah Okay, some trauma, trauma, trauma. Ouvre tes portes de donjon de cerveau, de chambre de cœur. Ouvre tes grâces d'université, de baisers à Dieu. Selon Daniel, le 
les technocrates juifs veulent contrôler le monde pour mieux régner. Depuis Hitler. Wow. What a revelation. God's battle plan first. Fighting bright and living army. Loving army. That's a God's battle plan. First question. This is a teaching by James Gall. He said, shall we go up? How are we to go? And where do we go? And will you go with us? That's Graham Cook actually he said that. So the principle, some battles are for others. Some battles are for another day. And no, yeah, that's James Gall. He said that. Some battles are for other days. Some battles are for others. And some battles are not to fight. And others, we must fight. But Christ must lead and pick and you must pick your battle example davidic runners movement the, the give it all campaign jesus told the rich young ruler and put it on all people and we put it on, yeah that's the thing we put it on people but you told just one this one rich young ruler you know anyway lord tell us tell me who feeds fine Yeah, why do you think I'm rich? I should demand a frère. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't transcribe anything. I wrote Rêve de dévoilement. Oh, yeah. This is a revelation at the end of the US election uh, on the 8th of January. I wrote. I had this dream here where it's where my brother and my dad, they like uh, me and uh, were uh, Samson, like a figure, Samson figure. Maybe more me and my brother rather than my dad. But so anyway, so we were uh, missing discernment to come out because of a bad uh, witch, a bad uh, saying, dicton mauvais. Don't malediction on a curse. Yeah. Because of a curse. So anyway, he revealed that uh, each time that I was communicating with my cousins or my my sister cousins, you know, from the Christian community, uh, he said that the enemy works in team to be against us in the curses. So anyway, we should pursue wisdom and covet righteousness. And I got the whole tone app, which is amazing. Amazing relaxation tool. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Gertzman. Oh my God. My rabbi had, had some virgin island. Not island, but virgin... Earth, not earth, the terre vierge. Oh. And uh, two prostitutes was two prostitutes were inhabiting the the, the uh, virgin uh, earth. Maybe it's earth vessel. I don't know, but it's it's to receive the 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 uh, it's to receive the air. Uh, Plane, airplane uh, drivers, how you call them? Uh, anyway, airplane drivers that uh, I was, and so I was an airplane driver, and so so there's two prostitutes that live there that are ready to receive me, but I was preferring to throw. Le tabouret qui me réservait pour les faire asseoir. Oh God, why did I wanted to throw the the bench uh, over the window? I'm sorry, Lord. This is ridiculous. I'm sorry. God is confronting me. God is confronting my attitude and my response to Jesus. So the keys to the kingdom, according to mm, money, medic, Mary, medic, 
first is faith, the second is obedience, and third is suffering. Yeah, I was complaining that she mentioned suffering, but but it's she found that it's the third element, third key to the kingdom is suffering. But right now I'm suffering on my tongue. Lord, deliver me from this python spirit. I don't know what spirit is creating this. Maybe it's just um, my uh, diet, you know, what I eat. Uh, a bit sugary, maybe I should replace the sugar with uh, some honey, I don't know. Anyway, so this is my uh, new campaign here on print as it is on screen. On print as it is on screen. Maybe I wrote it different on my album cover, but anyway, enjoy it. But please... Um, PayPal me if you ever use it for a profit, you know. And uh, so be blessed. That was my podcast for today. It is 12.01 under Metatarsal user on my 2013 tower. Uh, I, I knock a tower. And, well, it's not a tower, but what? It's like a tower anyway and uh, be blessed and have an excellent day Ooh, let's pray let's finish with prayer uh, Lord uh, we are convinced that you are the purpose for the church in Israel and our lives belongs to you but Lord you have a plan for us and you have a hope and a future and we pray for that glorious calling and election to be uh, our share in wisdom, wisdom with God, planning with God, retiring with God, working with God, always with you, in you, through you, Father, we ask the grace to carry on that sh sharing capacity you gave me, but also open the hearts, chambers of the hearts of many people that will be subverted to your kingdom and then we're going to convert them to your ways but first we need to con be converted to the idea of a good good father god thank you lord blessing peace grace and honor for joel's army for our relations with colleagues with local local communities but want to go abroad and build father businesses for your glory and as chuck pierce mentioned Trump, we're calling the Trump trumpets of God to trump the time. It's going to be my time, says the Lord. It's going to be Chuck's time. It's going to be God's time. God's timeline, God's timing, God's calendar. It's going to prevail this year. We tr claim it, we proclaim it, and we say, Lord, Lord, have, have your ways in us and by your grace, by our Epigrace University, we shall conquer land and decipher mysteries and find back the treasures of resourceful people we once lost because of our character, Lord. Redeem our character, we pray. Erase our name from the book of death and inscribe us in the book of life throughout all the media may our name be listed in the very book that saves and the good uh, honor culture spirit that we want to carry and transmit through through you Lord none else there's no other God beside you we thank you and receive all the power the songs deliverance receive all the grace and thanks that you deserve and that we forgot to tell you all throughout the day in Yeshua in Jesus name Amen Bye Bless you Good night You may not May I bow You may not sit down and bless you Okay Majesty Part 3 
Mm-hmm. Let's continue. And if you are present in a place, occupy it in Jesus' name. Then He will teach you how to enter in and to occupy the place where you live. And the Father says, I have marked out the places where I will give you specific, give you specific authority to overcome as you learn the process of maturity, majesty. Let's see. Yes, the process of uh, majesty, rather. Uh, so, you know. Basically, if you're present in a place, occupy it in Jesus' name, that He will teach you how to enter and to occupy the place where you live. And the Father says, I have marked out the places where I will give you specific authority to overcome as you learn the process of majesty, okay? Majesty is what got you into this situation, and majesty will get you out. You are in the situation you're in because of the fullness of God and the fullness of God will also deliver you. There is no power that can successfully oppose you on the level that you inhabit in His beloved Son. There is not power that works against you. So you can't allow for a thought that takes you down that road. As you reign in your low places, so will I elevate you to inherit more, says the Lord. As I was with Jesus, so I will be with you, that the power of my words will reside within your heart and my favor would abound. This is the time when the favor of God is abounding in the earth and it needs to abound in you. I'm not broke, says the Lord. I'm not broke, I'm not short of funds. I'm not short of resources, but I need you to partner with me in an extraordinary fate. I'm looking for men and women of extraordinary fate. Don't think about how you will build something, just think about getting the plans drawn out. When you got the plans drawn out, think about digging the foundations. When the foundations are dug, think about the next part of the building. Don't think about <coughs> the whole thing. Don't think about it in the steps. Think, uh, actually, think about it in the steps that I will take you through. Take the steps of faith and believe me for this level to be built and I'll build it. Believe me for the next level to be built and I'll build that. B believe for the next building to be built and I'll build that. And I won't give it to you all at once, but I'll give it to you. But you have to work with me and partner with me every single step of the way. I will never leave you nor f will I fail you or forsake you in my way. I will be with you always. Look for me in your circumstances and you'll find me. Look for me. I'll give you the money for the next segment. Then I'll give you the money for the next segment. And when you are there, I'll give you the money for the next segment and we'll do it piece by piece line upon line brick by brick we will get this thing built but the building of it will have built your faith up and that's what that's what i'm interested in says the lord i want i want the relationship of partnership and establish you at a higher level through what i bestow upon you I have territory that belongs to you and you must possess your possessions and become a people of promise. Be careful to follow in my wisdom. Be careful to follow the steps of faith. Receive my perception. Think the same thought as I do regarding your favor and your blessing. Beloved, do not turn away from favor. Step into my abundance. My will is to promote you. This is your time to, to regain my strength and power and learn the way of courage. 
Be strong and very courageous. I'm looking for men and women of substance. Men and women who will make a difference. Men and women of renown. Men and women who will be famous for what they believe. Men and women who will see something as though it's not. Who will see the things that are not. And speak to them as though they are. But allow yourself to be hoodwinked by the enemy who sees the things that are and speaks to them as though they are not. Don't get taken in by that. You can do this thing. Have I not been with you? Have I not proven myself? This is your time to prove me in a new way. Let's get this thing done, says the Lord. So, Father, we just pray. I just pray, Lord, that right now and right here in this place, we need to leave this weekend with a mindset rooted in a majesty. The mindset that brought us into this place will not take us in to the next place that you've got for us. We need a mindset rooted in a majesty. There are some Ka Caleb's in this place, Joshua's in this place. There are people of promise. There's Esther's, Deborah's in this place, Mary's in this place. Be it unto me according to your word. There are men and women. There are game changers, warriors, champions in this place this evening. And I ask, Lord, right now, I ask for a move of your spirit just to sweep through this auditorium and settle upon us, settle the questions in our heart. Are you not Lord over everything? Then be Lord in this and teach me your majesty in this situation that I'm currently facing that feels overwhelmed. And Lord, the promises that you have given us, the pro prophecies that you have given us, we ask Lord for a performance of these works in our current situation. We believe, Lord, that this is our moment to rise up, to stand up, to rise up and occupy a level that you've set aside for us for quite some time now. So I ask that you would root every one of us in a mindset of majesty. Hallelujah. Majesty, majesty, majesty. Amen.